Hey guys, how are you feeling? Well, this review is going to be a little bit old. Last year, Canon introduced lots of new lenses and cameras, and the prices started getting a little bit on the astronomic side. Well, it's been a year and there has been definitely some changes, but I'm still with Nikon and I'm still so happy with the change I made. And here's why, why I used to be a Canon guy and now I'm using Nikon. Well, there are so many reasons behind that. The very, very first one is that I really felt cheated with Canon. As you realize, Canon introduced 24 to 70 2.8 the newest version. There's an extremely huge price difference in between the older version and the new one. And the new one is, well, it's sharper, but that's it. I'm not going to pay twice the price just because the lens is sharper. I'm just going to stop my lens down, period.
Well, everybody complained about the 5D Mark II's autofocus system. And I was also an owner of 5D Mark II. I was really satisfied with that camera, but I hated one thing, the autofocus system. And unbelievably, if you want to get a 6D, 6D had the same autofocus system. I think they added like two more focusing points on that, like it made a difference. On top of that, if you want to get the 5D Mark III, which has the autofocus system that everybody wanted to have for years. I'm living in Europe and in Germany, when they introduced this camera, it costed around 3,200 euros. That makes approximately almost 4,000 US dollars. Upgrading to 5D Mark III? No, Canon, I'm not going to do that. And one of the reasons why I switched to Nikon is this lens in here. I had the Canon 85mm 1.2. That lens is awesome. However, it's one kilo, 1,000 grams. It's heavy. Plus, it also, although it's a prime lens, it also sticks in and out. And after... I laid my hands on the 85mm 1.4 G of Nikon. I'm super satisfied with it. I think they are really um, a tie when you compare the sharpness, bokeh. You know my review about it. I'm not trying to just say bad things about Canon in here. And to be honest, one of the biggest recent big mistakes of Nikon was with the Nikon D600. As you, as you all know, Nikon D600 had this oil and dust problem that was related to the sensor system, as I believe. And people complained about this as soon as the camera was on market. And amazingly, Nikon did not took these items back. And what they did was introducing the D610. And I think... This is one of the most ridiculous things a big camera manufacturer can do. I mean, how come you're introducing a camera that is problematic, everybody's complaining about it, and then instead of recollecting them back and giving these people free D610 in exchange with their D600, you're introducing a new one? No way. I mean, we are paying thousands of dollars to both camera companies, not for you know, uh, paying for their crippled cameras. So, guys, learn from this. Do not buy the cameras or lenses when they are introduced. Wait for it. Actually, one of the reasons why I switched from Canon is because I like the Nikon, the design of the Nikon camera so much better. Um, and I liked also the design of the lenses, you know, this uh, black and gold. So actually I find myself a lot of times whenever I was at a photography store, um, you know, looking at the Nikon cameras. So it's also a little bit about the taste. But is it a reason for switching? No. This is totally personal. So in the past Nikon used to be even more expensive than Canon. And in the future uh, this can be also the same. Nikon might be more expensive in the future and they might immediately decide just like the Canon. So is it a reason to switch? No. So it's all about you. Just decide. No matter if you lose money, trust me, you're going to be much more peaceful with the gadget that you want. Guys, also let me tell you this. Both camera manufacturers are almost equal to each other because some make better cameras, some make better lenses. One lens is better than the other one. One camera is better than the other one. So it's actually all about, it's actually all about that bass. All about that bass, about that bass, no trouble. I'm all about that bass, about that bass, no trouble. I'm all she says boys like a little more booty to hold a knife. So thank you everyone for watching. And please subscribe, comment, and share if you like the video. Um, and I'd like to thank everyone for subscribing. Um, only recently I had only 10 subscribers. And I see that right now I have more than 800. And I really do appreciate that. Stay tuned and keep your cameras with you because the best camera you have 
is the one that you have always with you.